What is going on YouTube? Today we're going to be tackling a 12 minute high intensity workout that's good for torching fat. There's going to be three sections of this workout. The first section is going to be a 50 second on, 10 second off system. So exercise one to exercise four for that system. And then we're gonna hit exercise five and then switch to a 40 second on, 20 second off routine. We're going to maintain this style for another four exercises. And then we're gonna proceed to a 30 second on, 30 second off system for the rest of the workout. So for exercise 9 through 12, so in essence we'll be working with decline in tempo. So complete this circuit for one or two rounds. You can also do it as a supplement to other workouts you've done throughout the day, say at the end of your workout. Okay, for our first one we have some fast line heel taps. For this one you want to lay on your back and just tap your heels alternating each time. Just make sure you're going as fast as possible. You can always slow down the tempo if you find it difficult to do. Okay, let's quickly switch into a plank position and complete some mountain climbers for 50 seconds. Make sure you're pacing yourself. For the next one here, you want to get on your feet and complete some star jumps. Make sure you're jumping as high as possible. For the final exercise in this 5010 system, you want to complete some alternating toe taps. I hope you guys are still with me. Take longer breaks by pausing the video if needed. 40 seconds for the next one.
for exercise number six. So 40 seconds, 20 seconds is what we're working with now. Spider X hip twist plank. Make sure you control your back with this one and keep it neutral. Our seventh is going to attack all sections of your body and torch some calories. So jumping jack X ab walkouts. Make sure that you're completely walking out until your back is fully straightened out each time before coming back. At number seven, we're going to be crunching our obliques and our lower abs. So side crunch X, knee to elbow. Make sure you're exerting as much force as possible and bringing your knees towards your elbows as close as possible each time. Back on the floor for our next one right here, knee to V-tox. Bring your knees from being straight out all the way to crunching your lower abs and then do a wider version of it for a V-tox. And try to keep your feet from completely resting on the ground. Moving to the final stage of 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off. Okay, back into a plank position for our next one here, alternating knee crunch X scissors. All you have to do is bring your knees towards your elbows, alternating each time, and then do a scissor to complete each rep. Another 30 seconds for this right here. We're almost to the end, guys, so stick with me right here. Let's keep pushing through.
At number 11 and 12, we have Woodchopper X Side Crunch. So we're going to begin with A, which is just one side. So pick your favorite side and start with that. Just make sure to follow the move as you see on the screen right now. You basically want to complete a Woodchopper. Make sure you're extending your body as far back as possible. And then you complete a Side Crunch on that same side. Okay, we're done right here. Congrats. I hope you guys push through this one right here. Complete one or more sets if you're feeling like it. And I will see you guys in my next video. It's Midas, and I'm out of here, y'all.